Hello, sports fans and football fans, particularly out there. It's me, Sportsman Z, and today I'm going to talk about the USFL. Now, you know, if you watch my channel, that I do uh, weekly uh, picks of games for the upcoming weekend in the USFL. And I also do a slight recap of the week before with a few highlights. And I enjoy doing that. But um, how much longer am I going to be doing that? And that's the question. Because is the USFL going to survive? And I'm here to give you three things that I think the USFL absolutely has to do in order to survive past their inaugural season. Number one on that list is every team needs to play in its own home city and not in Birmingham, Alabama, except for the Birmingham Stallions. But every other team needs to play at home. Philadelphia needs to play in Philadelphia. The Stars or the uh, Generals need to play in New Jersey. The um, Panthers need to play somewhere in, in Michigan, probably in Detroit, uh, etc. That has to happen. Because right now, I'm sure you know, if you watch the USFL or if you're familiar with anybody who talks about the USFL, you know that. First of all, it doesn't draw very well in general. But the only games, or the games that get the most uh, uh, people to come out, are the Birmingham games, because all of the games are currently in Birmingham. Funny how that works. So uh, they've got to definitely, they've got to go back to their own cities. Now I think that the plan for next year uh, for the USFL is to do that, and they definitely need to. The second thing that they have absolutely got to do is they need to expand the league to at least 12 teams. Eight teams ain't going to cut it. Four games every week, eight teams, that's not going to cut it. You've got to expand to at least 12 and have six teams in the north, six teams in the south, or rename the divisions or whatever you got to do, but you got to have 12 teams. And sort of related to that, you should expand the schedule too. Currently it plays 10 games. I think they need to go to at least 12, um, 12 games. And really 14 teams would be ideal, but it's tough for me to see them going from uh, the current uh, eight teams to 14 teams. That would be a little much. And then the third very big thing that they need to do is they need to expand the roster size of the rosters. Currently, they don't carry, like a, an NFL team, I'm not sure what the number is. I think it's 54 players. But whatever it is, the USFL does not carry anywhere close to that number of players. And for the life of me, I don't know why. Because it's hard for me to imagine that you can't find, um, you know, I don't know. Um, however many players it would be to fill out your rosters to 54 teams, especially right now with only eight, um, 54 players, um, especially right now with only eight teams. Because how many college players, you know, left college and said, man, you know, that's the last time I'm ever going to play football, but would really love to keep playing football. You know, I don't think it's as much an issue of how good the players would be as it is that you you should certainly be able to find people who would still be willing to keep playing, keep their careers going, and keep playing football. Because remember, you know, 
everybody complains about the quality of the players in the USFL, that they're not as good as the NFL. Well, guess what? They don't have to be as good as in the NFL because it's a league of, you know, I don't want to say amateur because if you're getting paid, you're not amateur. But it's a league full of players that aren't NFL quality players by and large. So, you know, the, the, the talent level is, is relative. So that's, um, you know, what do you guys think? Is there anything else that you would have on your list? I mean, certainly there are other things I could say that would make the league better, that would give it maybe a better chance. But those were my three major things. Play in your own cities, expand the league to at least 12 teams, and expand the roster size to a regular NFL roster size, 54 players. So let me know what you guys think. I'd be interested to hear um, any ideas. Uh, but for right now, that is my USFL talk, and that is it for me, Sportsman Z. Bob Zolke, signing off.